It was a day that changed the city of Stockton. One year ago today, three men stormed into the Bank of the West, robbed the bank, took hostages, and then led police on a bloody chase and shootout that stretched for miles. Tonight, people are remembering the victims in that case that has shaken the Stockton community. KCRA 3's Melinda Mesa now with how Misty Holtzing's family and the police department are remembering that day. Today's emotional. Um, got a lot of, you know, uh, messages from friends and family and uh, even strangers. Paul Singh says life will never be normal for him or his children after his wife, their mother, was killed in a chase and shootout. It was one year ago today, police say gang associates Gilbert Renteria, Alex Martinez, and Jaime Ramos went into the Bank of the West, robbed the bank. When police arrived, they took three hostages, two towers, and Misty Holt scene. The high-speed chase began, an hour-long shootout with more than 60 police cars. Police say Holt Singh was used as a human shield. And then the third text came in, they took mom. Paul Singh was notified by his 12-year-old daughter, Mia, who went to the bank with her that day. He left work and was told to go to the police station. The whole family was in the next room, and uh, he called me back in, and uh, he told me that Misty had died. It was the most tragic um, event that we'd ever seen. Stockton Police Chief Eric Jones says the dynamics that day were unique and that was not a typical hostage situation. Those very violent assailants absolutely had to be stopped that day. The department has ordered a national review. Chief Jones says any changes to procedures will be made after that review is finalized. Today, one year later, Three hostages have filed claims against the city of Stockton and the police department. Two men are in jail, one facing the death penalty. The bank is now a Starbucks, and the Singh family is trying to cope. It touched a lot of people's lives. You know, the message, I think, at now is, is loved your loved ones because you don't know when they're, they're going to be gone. In Stockton, Melinda Meza, KCRA 3 News.